Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. So on um, this episode, we're here, as you can see, at um, GridServe. But this is the second of 100 plus planned sites like this around the UK. Um, dedicated charging facility, as well as food and everything else you'd expect for electric vehicles. Um, so what does this make this more special than, say, um, Braintree that um, you would have seen on a previous video. Um, well, this design is slightly different and we'll take a look, walk around, but basically all the facilities are above, whilst the charge is, in, uh, is either side underneath the building, whereas uh, Braintree you would probably remember is that it's a big canopy type uh, building. So it's more, um, the footprint for this is a lot more efficient. Now this place has got 22 350 kilowatt chargers as well as I believe six 22 kilowatt chargers and a bank of about I think six Tesla 250 kilowatt chargers which will go up to 300 I believe through software updates soon. Um, so, but as you can see I mean this facility like GridServe's other facilities are amazing. Um, it's in a perfect location, so um, I will put the location um, below here um, so you can see, but it's um, the other side of Norwich, so the coast side, east coast side. So what makes this really good for me is that I've always used uh, the odd facility in Norwich if I'm coming down to the east coast from Hertfordshire. There's a good 90 odd mile uh, drive. And in my i3, I'd kind of get to Norwich, but then have to charge to do anything else in the air as well as get home. Now, um, if I still had my i3, it wouldn't even be a problem because I'd come here, I'd charge for the entire sort of rest of the day and do it on the way home. With my Zoe, it's even easier. So I, get, I got here, I started off this morning with 87% with 200 miles. I went for Fetford Forest this morning for a ride came here with about 60 miles left, um, charged up to full, now back up to 200. More than enough, quick speeds, reasonably priced um, as per all the other GridServe facilities. What should be noted as well is that what GridServe have achieved and exactly what they've said they would do even during um, the worldwide pandemic. Now, if you take, for instance, they, um, they bought out Ecotricity and the electric highway, they said that they would upgrade all of those sites less than a year. They've done that in 10 months. They're now rolling out dual charging as of, I think, a couple of days ago, which means those dual head chargers that you see with double CCS, soon you'll be able to use both of those if, if two of you turn up, which has always been a bit of a problem. So that's another benefit. And to build something like this, in the middle of a pandemic when there's global supply chain shortages and everything else. It's, it's quite an achievement. And for this area, it's definitely going to be worthwhile for, um, for this East Coast area. So if you're coming down on a holiday, it's right kind of, um, it's on the right side of, uh, of Norwich in the, fa uh, sorry, yeah, of Norwich. Basically to allow you to then further explore the other parts of, of the East Coast, which is, is, is brilliant. So um, hats off to like all the team at GridServe um, and um, you know, a big thank you to GridServe for inviting me and others down um, here for the, this is the pre uh, day before launch. Um, so when this video goes up, this one will already be live and you'll be able to use it. Um, if you've got an electric car and you're in the area, come and use it. If you're thinking about coming on holiday to the East Coast, perfect location to come here, charge and explore the area. Um, so let's take a look around. So we're just underneath one of the canopies. As you can see, there's uh, enough parking everywhere. There's some um, 22 kilowatt charging over there. And then under here, you've got banks of 350 kilowatt chargers with everyone charging. Um, thank you GridSurf today for the free charge. And um, yeah, there's plenty of plenty of people charging here, which is great. Um, plenty of different electric cars. Um, so let's just take a look out the front. I'll try not to get run over in the same time. Um, it really is quite an impressive building. 
that grid surf are doing exceptionally well in that front. As you can see, all the banks are charging along here, and then obviously the facilities above. Um, but yeah, and then over there we've got all the Tesla superchargers as well. Let's take a look around. So like I said, all of these are 350 kilowatt. It, might, it was worth noting as well that every single one of these banks or every one of these chargers and the facility itself is fully accessible. So if you are disabled or you've got um, some sort of walking problems and things like that, or you know, you, you can get to the chargers easily. There's, there's ramps, uh, there's all the chargers underneath the canopy are all flat. So all this, all the Teslas. We'll take a look upstairs in a minute as well. Um, but yeah, it's all flat surfaces around as well. And a nice little tie can. Yummy. Um, but yeah, as you can see, it's pretty impressive. Um, we're going to run down this side as well. So, <laughs> little Model Y. Yes, ID3. Jag. I mean, the facilities are fantastic. It's what, now what you come to expect as normal from GridServe, which is something that in the days of ooh, IX, um, something in the days of ecotricity, oh yeah, <laughs> um, you wouldn't thought that I'd be saying. I mean, ecotricity, to be honest, were terrible, and GridServe, in a short space of time, have really turned it round. So you can see, there's the other side to all the bunkers of chargers along here. Um, facilities upstairs. So, as you can see, really impressive location. Uh, plenty of spaces, as you can see, all the places behind us, all flat floored and everything else. So plenty of uh, space and, uh, and I'm just about to be run over by these damn EVs, they're so quiet. <laughs> Um, but loads of facilities uh, here as well. Um, but yeah, really impressive, um, perfect location, and um, yeah, brilliant site. Anyway, um, let's take a look upstairs. It's worth noting as well that um, as all grid surf stuff, it's all contactless payment, so no mucking around with RFID cards or anything daft like that. So. Nice and easy, swipe your cards and away you go charging. Easy, quick and painless. Okay, so let's have a quick look round upstairs. Um, it's very familiar, quite similar to the Braintree site. Um, so, get up the stairs. I'll be quite busy up here, so um, if you can't hear me, then apologies, but I will show you around upstairs. So normal coffee facilities like Costa and M&S. Upstairs, presentation So again, really nice facilities. Look outside. <laughs> Looking at room facilities. So there you have it, GridServe at Norwich now, well, will be now open as of when this video goes up. Be sure to check it out. Again, thank you very much to GridServe for the invite, um, for using this when we come down to the East Coast. And thank you very much for watching everyone. See you on the next one. Bye-bye.